Well, you start off dreaming about it. And then you go and chase it. You find it. And then you ride it. It doesn't matter if you're a surfer or a musician or a you know, photographer. Finding that elusive bit of perfection out there is what it's all about. 100 reels of priceless film thought to be lost forever resurfaced. One day he got up in the Cessna, you know, and just started dropping acid. White lightning was everywhere. I mean, it was insane. We were the surfers, and we were the designers, and we were self-creating this whole new experimental thing. they don't like you, they're gonna, your car's gonna have every window broken and all the tires slashed. You just didn't cruise up in your rental car and throw a land over to the local and say, Aloha, I'm here to surf your wave. We discovered the biggest candy store for surf there could ever be. The surf just was there every day, perfect. No one around. It was like a dream. It was an exciting time. Their surfing was unleashed there. Both Weaver and Spider, they were on their own wavelength, you know, and they just would go do stuff that nobody else was doing. An adventure spanning four decades. A search across five continents in the pursuit of perfection. They were like the last guys to shoot film, movies, before video really kicked in. And video became the cheap way. Greg and Spider really inspired a, a lot of people to get out and hit the road and travel. And my whole philosophy is you can't be scared to look back, to go forward. You can always learn something from somebody in the past.